Yo, yo, what's good? What's good? We right back here, man, with another episode of the Prolific Podcast. I've been chilling for a minute, had some shit to get right, like we all do. But nonetheless, we back. This episode, though, it's, it's going to be a little special one, right? I got some guys up here, some real special guys of the city that y'all should know if y'all already don't know. But today, this is what we're going to make this platform for. We're going to get it out there. We're doing some special things here in the city with some of the younger guys. We're talking about the 7U football level. A lot of these guys can't do it. It might look easy when you're watching it. It takes some talent to do it. And we're putting it on, we're putting it on for the city right now. And again, today we're going to talk about it. So, we got some top dogs in the city this year. Some top dogs in the house. We got the South Philly Sharks here. We got the Sturgis Hornets. And we got the motherfucker Frank with charging here. What's good, gang? It was good. What's good? Make sure you talking to Mike, bro. So I told you we gonna get on air. Now we are gonna chill. No, no, seriously, man. So these are the guys that's doing a lot of shaking and moving, a lot of championships, one in the city, putting a lot of good kids like up in this. These, you guys that's coaching these nine U's and these ten U's, eleven U's, whatever. You about to look at the guys that's been doing it. That's been blessing y'all with that talent, and that's going to do it for the years to come. So what's going on, dude? What's up, my brother, South Philly Sharks? What's good, man? Champion. That's me for life from here. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what's up. That's what it is. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. What's good, bro? What's good? Sturge, if you here? You already know. The new dogs in the tent, the new dogs in the, in the kennel? We in AYF now, man. Like, so y'all are coming over now. We in the AYF now. We in AYF. No more the small fish? No more. No, we on that competition now, bro. Yeah, yeah. Man, Juice, what's up, man? What's up, man? You know, here, Coach Frank for Chargers, Little Soldiers, P Elite <laughs> undefeated champion. You, know what I mean? you got that look on your face. Yeah. <laughs> you trying to start some we shit. invested too much into these boys, man. Huh? Man. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're going to get to that. Uh, starting off with dude, man. What y'all got going on, bro? Let these folks know where you at, where you're coaching at, what you got going on this year. Yeah, no, I'm uh, I'm moving down to 7U this year. You know, normally I'd be with the older guys. All the challenge going down there, trying to build it up the young guys, you know, through the program. I mean, we got something good going on down there. That's what's up, man. That's what's going on. So you say you had the seven you last year, this year. Where were you at last year? Uh, thirty U Sharks. That's in your how y'all do? How y'all finish the year out that year? How y'all, uh, how, y'all, how y'all year go? Tough loss in the championship to the Panthers. You know, good good game. Or oh, every game we had last year was a barn burner. Every one. Um, you know, gotta move on now, man. Kids going off to high school, just doing something different. I'm gonna tell you how comp- one. How competitive I am right now still You know what I'm talking about But yeah, I, I but listen But I give you that much respect And that shit still hurt you Notice I called you champ I totally forgot all about the fucking West Philly game All my fucking life bro I totally forgot about it That's why I just said Yo what's up champ Because I totally forgot about that I'm about to think you about to get on here Like yeah we won the championship Whatever whatever Right Nah But you say you talk a little, to- a little tough loss Yeah no it was a tough loss man You know A couple of things that go our way The football guys wasn't working with us that day And uh we we fell short. I mean, you can't win every year, right? Yeah, yeah definitely. I know. <laughs> well, what's up, my man Sturgis? Sturgis fucking Sturgis. Sturgis Hornets is in the Sturgis motherfucking Hornets. building. Sturgis Hornets, Coach Mills, man. Coach Mills. That's what's up, man. Mm-hmm. Coach Mills, what's good? Where you at this year, brother? Where you, you coaching? What y'all doing? I'm at six. Uh, I'm at seven. You. I'm, I'm, I had to leave six you alone. I mean, okay. I want to step it up, get the competition. I mean, so three years straight since mm-hmm. 2020. I won three straight championships with uh, six U. I was three waiting. I was waiting to see who was gonna be so, the first one to pop so. the championship shit. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I'm you got bring it. The trophy here. Like, that was my last. Uh uh-huh. last game. I thought champion. he was gonna do it. <laughs> I thought he was going to do it. No, I thought he was going to do it. The tri-state tri- trophy. The, the one that, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. 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 Hey, let's let it be known, man. We got some guys in here. Frankfurt, Frankfurt is definitely in this bitch, y'all. Uh, your Frankfurt family, Frankfurt Charles, y'all definitely in this bitch heavy representing, man. But uh, what's up, Juice? No, keeping the train rolling. We got to defend our title, man. We got to come back stronger than before. What title is that? I mean, I know. I know. I've been having my, I've been watching. But for the people that haven't been watching, man, like these guys, you kind of you knew on the scene. I, first time I think I met you was last year. You know what I mean? We met through on the field, me working and you working. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But let these folks know, who, for the people that don't know you, let these guys know who you are, where you at, what you got going on. Yeah, I'm from North Philly. Just started coaching, got into it, really, my son and all that. First year. We just building these kids up, trying to bring back the Chargers, man. Really bring it, investing in everything we got into these kids, giving it back. And that's what I give back to mostly everybody that we be doing this, like outside of football, like everybody that's like me. Like we really giving back to these kids, and that's what it's really mostly about. You know, even though we were so competitive, but that's what we building the culture now for the next youth coming up. We building this culture. Y'all Definitely. Know everything going to be competitive, you know? Yeah, man. That's what it's about. 
So, um, everybody's going to be in the same league next year. Mm-hmm. They talked about it. All these other guys, cover coaches talked about it. We actually going to do it. You know, I don't, I'm not sure if it's your whole org or is just your ages that's all coming to AY. Is it the whole org? It's the whole org. It's the whole, whole org. org. So, yeah, we should have, like, uh, last year we had three teams, uh, 6U, uh, 7U, and 9U. So ne- this year coming up, the whole org going to go to uh, PA Elite. We should have about five teams. I think that's going to make like y'all – Six through ten. I think that's going to make y'all super strong to start y'all org at that age. Y'all have no choice but to stay together, and them kids going to move up together. But y'all – as coaches, we all got to make sure y'all keep putting them kids in a position to win, though. Because you know how shit get a little it's a lot, shaky. There's a, a lot to learn in this game, man. Yeah. So that's it, man. You gotta, you but you got to be it. You have, to, you have yeah. to go through that to know that shit, though. Exactly. And a lot of them don't. They go through adversity, and the first thing they want to do, you know, they ready, they ready to get busy. They ready to get out of there. Facts. Mm-hmm. They ready to get out of there. But, uh, dude, man, we was up rumbling up at that 13U level, and um, now we both we took a huge step down. To a lot of guys don't and won't do. Right. And I think it's a little hard of a challenge for us because we're a little behind the eight ball because we had other business and building other things. And I think you you still shaking and moving with, um, what's that? You got uh, 14s now. Yeah. So, you know, <clears throat> you know, normally 13, you and 14, you my thing. I don't really go lower than that. I think the lowest I've ever been was like 12, you. Um, the last few years before this year. Seven consecutive championships, Florida appearances, and all type of crazy stuff. So, I need a challenge. But we still doing fourteen U down South Philly. We still gonna be top tier with that. We still gonna do our thing. Fortunate enough, all our fourteens been winning. We've been going down Florida. We've been we never been in the the national championship game in the last few years. We've been in the third place game. We just can't get over that hump, man. Down there is a different beast. Everybody knew that that been down there. Um, players, coaching, all that matters big time down there. So, I mean, we just trying to build to, to you know, get these kids the opportunity to, um, you know, to win. And, you know, fourteen U is is huge for these guys because they ain't gonna never do this again. Right? Like you are gonna be that guy outside the gate next year talking about damn, I was, I was that guy on this field last year. Mm-hmm. I fell short because of this or that. So my thing is, I want to give them the best opportunity. Best chance enjoy the last year of youth football, you yeah. know. So I that, think that's a, a that's a big deal that we can attest to that, especially mm-hmm. with Juice and y'all, man. When y'all got these guys and y'all gonna be with some of these kids yeah. throughout the year, even if you stay in this division for a couple years, and then you might want to, they might want you to move up because your your style of play, your coaching right. might be top tier. It's not even so much it's just about oh I can't move up out this uh out this age group, but you, they might say with well, them. Bro, you've been winning championships down there. Your style of coaching is might be for the next level for the age group. That's cool, but you can go up and coach these guys. This time is gonna go by quick. So whenever y'all can pit into it, flying. bro, the time's flying. <laughs> so I never was a part of a whole a whole last ride thing, as you would say. Like we we named our shit like that. It obviously didn't end the way we wanted to, and that shit was painful, bro. And it was wasn't more so about the loss. It was when you come up on some cocky shit and you don't you don't think this is about to be it. Like none mm-hmm. of us on our roster thought like, okay, this is about to be it. You know what I mean? We thought we was gonna win because we beat those guys already and we was gonna advance to the championship and so forth and so on. Yeah. And when that shit came to a halt, bro, shit came to a crazy halt. And spe- excuse me. Especially when you gotta watch you on the opposing teams yeah. field. So you have to watch them do this shit. Watch them celebrate. Oh no! I'm gonna see y'all next year. Well, I'm gonna get back at your shit. No, ain't none of that shit. But that shit it's was so done. Funny. So again, that's gonna be for a later show that man do. We definitely gonna chop it up and get into. But I'm just saying that to say, make sure y'all got the time y'all pitting in. You don't get it back. Mm-hmm. Pay attention. Soak up all the motherfucking game you can. You know what I mean? And while you got these motherfucking kids, put them in the best position. Make sure that shit is about them. You know what I mean? It's, it's not just about us. You know what I mean? Cause we gonna be doing this shit for time to time. They got, I mean, for a long time to come if we really into it. These kids only got about six to ten years, and they're gonna be done with that shit. But down to the fucking business though. Y'all got some shit over there and with the charges. Good. Don't give me that modest shit. This is what we <laughs> not gonna do. That nice shit, all that whole cool, all that part of the interview is done. <laughs> that shit is done. Bullshit, we good, man. Y'all got some the shit going on over there. Here. We got a like we are org inside of org, so our team is different. Like yeah. so, it's like yeah, it's stuff going on, going on 
with the charge, but I way we started our team, you see how we all here. Mm-hmm. This is a fan. We move as a unit. We got everybody, everything is a structure. Mm-hmm. So it's like a lot of stuff, outside stuff don't affect us. That's, we know how our that's, super, is. that's super important. And I think y'all looking up mm-hmm. also on a good note for the Chargers to be in a big Oregon in the city, but yeah. not so much as with, with the success lately. Yeah. So for y'all guys to be coming up right now to get that new team, because they knew because they just started. Mm-hmm. And for y'all to be playing the way y'all playing and getting folks' attention and being yeah. called one of the top teams in the city, y'all Sturges and shit, man, that's a, that's a big deal. And yeah. that goes a testament to the way y'all guys coaching and all the good things that y'all doing with them kids, whatever. So, but I know it got to be some somebody in the city, some games that you're looking forward to. Oh, yeah. So that, I want my lick back. All of us who want that, my who, lick back. Oh, who that, who that did? That's on Sturgis Horn. Does he know? <laughs> oh, shit. Talk, so what we got to, we got, we, I, I didn't know. I didn't know. Yeah. Now, like I said, we all getting to know each other. That's what this, that's what this is about. Sturgis, what we talking yeah, about? Man. What we got going on? What happened with that? He waiting for the waiting for the setup. You know what okay. I mean? Okay. So y'all, met, y'all, y'all, y'all I, met last year? I, yeah, we met last year. <laughs> okay. What was the, what was the try, outcome? Tri-state, try, try regional. Tournament, okay. I mean, outcome thirty two twelve. Who that? Who won that shit? Y'all both smiling. Juice got that smile. Like, nigga, got I'm it. Gonna fuck. Yeah, he don't worry about you. Got this he said he won his lick back. He said he won his lick back. I ain't gonna lie. I felt like it's crazy because I felt like how the Forty Nine ers felt. Like they beating up and all that, but they still went in there. They had the. I mean, was that the real Forty Nine ers? No. So, so the only was champion. That the real so, the only, no. so, so the only champion we got in here right now is this motherfucker right here. That's it. Yeah, you can say that. I'm, I'm looking. I'm looking towards the regional. Mm-hmm. I'm looking towards the regional. Like mm-hmm. we're here, we in PA Elite right now. I'm glad. And you, I'm, I'm trying to compete. I'm trying to compete. I'm glad you at said that. Level. I'm glad you said that. So I'm one of the guys. Nationals is a big deal. Right, mm-hmm. it's not. It's not everything. It's not to me, especially at this level, because you have to teach the kids. They got to know, like they got. You got to teach them hard work and adversity, yeah. and they got to appreciate the wins that they get, because they all don't come that easy. Winning yeah. a city championship, it's a lot of people that never won a city championship. I work for. Them. So I'm not about to, and I know how good it felt when I won my first one. So every year I went about, I got a good amount, and every time felt. Felt great to me. Mm-hmm. I never won. You know, I mean, I, I, we before, we did the uh, Mighty Might Bowl down in Florida, uh, but every championship felt the same to me. Mm-hmm. And I and I like the championships better when I could beat the guys in my city. Mm-hmm. If you can't be the man in your city, you know, what I mean, you can't be the man on the road. Mm-hmm. Now a lot of guys say that. Well, I ain't worrying about beating the guys here because we got to go down south. Yeah, I, under- I, I understand. That. I'm with all that. And I went down there. I got my. I went on the road a few times, but I got my. I got my real, real road lick when we went to the Southern uh, Hospitality Zone, mm-hmm. and we went against some guys down there. Do I know you? You, you, you made you made it known that you went against some top competition, as far as the OG Ducks and things like that. So you can attest how tough it is. You know what I mean? So I don't really know. I'm, I'm about to ask you, how do you feel, as far as when it comes to city championships? To me, they're a big deal. I can't wait to beat the shit out of all y'all. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know what I mean? And it's whoever's going to be... Gonna be that's got a lot of work to do, bro. Tough and whoever's... That's, that's, that was a D2 team. My brother. <laughs> yeah. My brother. Yeah. Yeah. What's, my, that? What's that? Hold on. Right. What's that? What's that? What's, what we talking about? Blackhawks last year. Black sexual. Hawk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was but that, that was, coaching, coaching changed a lot, though. So I'm looking forward to it, though. Just like West uh, Philly, they upgraded their coaching. You're be better listen, off recording yeah, games. Listen, listen, no, no, they upgraded their coaching. You're going to be better off that. stay on your camera, bro. Sure, right? Sharks <laughs> <they laughs> upgraded their coaching. Better off behind the lens. Coaching, coaching listen, can't change. It do change a lot. I look at it like this. I mean, coaching definitely changed a lot. But, I mean, you look at it. Like, I'm going down at young ages more because it's more less competitive than me. Meaning, like... I care more about developing these kid more than I care about winning a bunch of championships. Now, don't get me wrong. I, I won so many where it gets to a point where, like, we'll win a championship, you won't see me get excited. I'm happy for the kids, you know, because this could be some of their first championships or whatever, but it's like, all right, well, what's next? For me, because I'm always looking for the next best thing yeah. because I want what's best for that kid's season. So last year at 14U, uh, we finished number four in the country at the end of the season. Um, we had our first state championship ever. We beat Pittsburgh. We we beat them down here right outside. We beat mm-hmm. them right, you know, we beat them right at the Blackhawks field, went down to Florida. Played uh played a tough Virginia Virginia team. I, I forgot the name of them, but we played them. Uh, we want I mean we wound up blowing them out eventually, like pulled away in the second half. Then <laughs> then you start going against the powerhouses, man, the Muscala Cowboys and the Vegas Strong and and dudes like that. And they the type of guys that I you know, that you know, at my level of thirteen or fourteen I play against every year. 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when you look at it like, yeah, it's cool beating teams in your city, and it means more because it's bragging rights more than anything for people. Like, who wants to go the whole year saying, hey, you might be 30 to nothing? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's more pride for you than anything. I just love the competition of right. being in my city. Like, where we from? We from Philly. Y'all know how this shit go. Y'all know how tough it is. I'm, and we got to see, and when where's though now? It's like, we got to see each other. What's up, Ern? <laughs> What's up, we got Ern in this Hey, hey I'm going to be Shout honest. So fat. I don't leave my, not even cut you off. I take more pride in, you know, like, Philly versus DMV than in my city. We can get there. I'm, 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 I'm going I'm, 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 I'm to get there. I'm going to get there a little later. But we got some good competition here at this level. And it's not to be looked over. That's just not to be looked over. Like, are we just worrying about, oh, we're going to get the floor? Because one of us fucking around not make it, yeah. looking over each other. Right. So, I mean, we could talk about all the aspirations, or we got to get down Florida, and, and that's what it's about. Shit, ain't, I, I'm be, I'm, I don't see a clear win in nobody, and I'm, I'm talking about myself. I'm going to come competitive. I'm, that's what we're coming for. We're coming for the chip. That's just a BH standard. We won't come for nothing less. But I'm that's also going to keep that shit. Cool. I'm also going to keep that shit 100, though. Yeah. I don't see a clear winner. You know what I mean? I so got we y'all we playing them in the D two chip. You still D2 talking to D two shit? You still talking to D two shit? That's all I'm talking about, bro. He got the D two mindset already. They gotta go. Listen, listen, listen. Can I? Division gonna be tough for the first year. So you got to be good. Can I say this though, bro? Out your fucking mind. I'm just saying, bro. I'm gonna be a part of any DJ. Can I? Can I say this though, bro? Guy, bro. I mean, even even speaking, even speaking of what bro said down at then, like. Man. Even like keep it one hundred, man. You be, we been crazy. we been rapping all year. Like you know, I don't be boasting. I don't be doing anything. I go in the field and do whatever. So you may hear me say what I'm saying now, but when when it's time to go, it's it's, it's gonna be a problem. Like no, like no. like because it's just just how I am. I'm just I'm not. You ain't gonna see me yeah, on. Dude, you know I got You know I got a way to pick at you though. Right, you know what I'm saying, I'm but I'm saying, look, look, deep, listen, keep, look, 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 keep it 100, bro. You don't do that quiet shit with me. Keep it 100. All, cool ass listen, right here in this middle. All year long, <laughs> that shit ain't popping game day. Yo, look, I'm gonna tell you, <laughs> I'm gonna give you a perfect example. All year long, man, it was three teams: Blackhawks, Sharks, Panthers. Right, that, yeah. that's what they were saying. The top three was. Everybody kept saying Sharks number three, Sharks number three. In my mind, until this very moment, I still know that I still feel like we the best 13 you in the city. I feel like we were sliding the championship to be 100, and a lot of other people feel the same way. I feel but the same way we was in the, we was sliding in the, in the semifinals game. Right, but so everybody gonna feel it. It's not fair to them. No, I'm no, I'm not taking away from nobody. What I'm saying is that uh-huh. you don't have to boast. And act crazy and be on Facebook and, and be right. like my man saying like I already got the D two mentality. No, I got the killer mentality because I'm a killer. Mm. So when we line up at the fifty and you like this shit, wasn't man. the boy that I was just talking to at the <laughs> at the joint. No, I wasn't. Now you now you now you see Satan. Yeah. I mean, now gonna, you see Satan, bro. How you feel, how you feel about your team? How you feel about your team? Yeah, how you feel about? Oh, bro, you had a couple workouts so far. How you feel about this team? It's a it's a we it's an empire here, my man. Like I said, you 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 new here. You know, hey, so enjoy your time. Mm-hmm. Enjoy your what time. What can I look forward hey. to in uh, PA Elite? Break it down to me. A whole lot. Competitiveness. A whole yeah. lot of coaching. Yeah. Kids now, more playing. It's competitive. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be competitive now at our it's division. Gonna be By far, we're going to have the most competitive I respect division. the teams. Don't get me wrong. Don't get the shit talking confused. Like, we, you know what I mean? I respect my opponent. And yeah. I, that's why I take my wins like I take my losses. I take my yeah. losses I take my wins. Don't get it wrong. I respect to, every opponent, but I'm confident shit. more into my kids because we practice too hard. I y'all gonna have to stand much. in that D two shit. Yeah, yeah. Y'all gonna have to stand in that D two shit. And I watch you. I watch oh, you gonna be like, fighting like two, three games. You lose. No, <laughs> listen, I like your energy. I like your energy again. I don't just talk to any motherfucking body. Anybody don't get my attention. So if y'all here, you got my motherfucking attention. Mm-hmm. So believe that. So don't don't fucking think for once this this whole D two shit. Y'all can get that shit out your head. I had no parts of that. Yeah, I like, I, was, I, I like okay. the, we got West Philly, yeah, yeah West Aztecs. Philly, no, Aztecs ain't no sleeper. West Philly, they Aztecs should be not, better. I'm gonna they got some out of, I'm gonna beat the shit out of both of them, like got y'all. The Sharks, yeah, yeah. that like, shit ain't gonna make no difference. Man. No, it's gonna be it's interesting. Gonna be I got something for that fucking. Now it's, AR, gonna, now it's gonna prepare our squad. I got squad. something for that fucking AR fifteen y'all got. <laughs> It got too that. much. I got something Listen, for that fucking big-ass AR-15 y'all shooting. You can shake your motherfucking head all you want. I got something for that he motherfucker. Getting, he getting help. That's you what's getting scary. You I ain't going to front, ain't gonna front bro. Help, I don't that's, know that's, nothing about the young like, ages. For him, he listen, going, listen, I'm blindsided listen, listen, with this John, bro. Y'all got some new recruits? Yeah. yeah so listen, so so listen. These they got they got a hitter. The young boys, he got my attention, all right? These little motherfuckers just got these little fast little motherfuckers. You know what I mean? So I mean, they're gonna be they're gonna be scraping and scrapping until they get hit. 
Ain't that what you need? Mm-hmm. To that get hit. Need that's them it, speeches it, at the young age, right? Is, I'm just, listen, y'all not, this is, not, this, this not no, the same coach. It's not that same 10 y'all winning. I, I, I'm literally watching. Now y'all had a good squad. I, I'm not disrespecting it. I ain't saying it. I'm just saying the way I run things. And I also, by head that, when I'm holding that camera right here, I had to watch the game as well. Mm-hmm. When I had to edit the bitch up, I had to watch the game. And so, you ain't recording none of our games, man. You no. got to pick one. You can record, no, no, no. you coaching, bro. No, no, no. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You oh, can't. Oh. You ain't be yeah, doing both. Yeah, I was trying to make a yeah. couple <laughs> movies this you year, man. No, Come you on, like. No you ain't no seven you <laughs> No seven you <laughs> You get you, you get mine. You know, I don't care if you get my footage. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to get my young boys. I got some young boys that's coaching. Yeah. I got some young boys that going to come film the game. But, but yeah, man. I, I, got like, I got like 12 kids. This would be their third year playing together at 7U. Yeah. At seven you. No, that's big time. Man. That's, that's I mean. Awesome. See, I ain't gonna front. I'm coming in. I'm coming in on a uh, on a new tip. Like I don't know nothing about it. I don't know no players. I don't even know these coaches. I mean, so I'll, I'm gonna be real with you. You want to know something crazy? What's up? I don't know none of my kids right now. <laughs> Neither do I. <laughs> I ain't that's had a workout. Saying. I ain't had a practice. I'm in seven on seven mood right that's now. But said, but when we get to it, I'm gonna get to it. And ain't yeah. nobody uh, ain't nobody out there on the, <laughs> ain't nobody out there getting them kids right like me. Hmm. It, it just ain't happening. So, I mean, we're going to be straight. That's how we feel. Uh, I mean, everybody should feel the yeah, same yeah, way. you should feel like that. Everybody should everybody feel the same way, man. Yeah, it's crazy. I ain't seen one six shoe game from my org last year. Like, I've been so busy. Like, you know, like, I, I also run my org. Mm-hmm. So, I feel I be, like six I be you like ain't all baby over. Ball. We six score you more. Six you ain't baby, we, we ain't no baby we, ball. We're making it hard for PA Elite to, like, change that rule, whereas, though, they can't send no six shoe to Florida. Like, mm-hmm. you almost at that peak. I know, felt that way. This we, When we was going back and forth about it, when we used to, I, on the coaches' corner, I don't know if y'all guys was on there, but years ago, they used to do a ranking. They used to rank all the age groups, right. and yeah. they would never rank mm-hmm. 75s. And I used to go crazy, like, damn, y'all ain't gonna show us no love, y'all ain't gonna show us no mm-hmm. love. But I'm kind of glad that they did that shit, because they gave us motivation. Because yeah. I wanted to get out of the, being on the field with the kids. I wanted to get out of every fucking play as a mm-hmm. handoff, running to the outside. We're gonna start yeah. hitting some yeah. gaps. We're gonna start throwing some we're gonna play some real football. No direct and snaps. it made us guys. Ain't no direct snap. Yeah, some, yeah, yeah. Some yeah. We're gonna football. Real some real football. Yeah. And by that time, it wasn't really nobody. I mean, when I came, when we was doing it, we used to go to the war, to war with Northwest Raiders yeah. and the, um, in the um, Oak Lane, the Wildcats. Those were like the two in the Essex. But they was in another league. So they was the big dogs in there. So we will always have the big games. But aside that, everybody else would get, like, they was guaranteed wins and shit like that. Mm-hmm. I don't really, really ever remember it being, like, this competitive. You know what I mean? Throughout the whole situation. So I think that's a good thing. I think that's a very good thing for the city. Because every game will be live. You know what I mean? I think... I, I don't think it's going to be no blowouts because it's just it's just a lot of talent and it's a lot of good coaching. That's no, the main thing. No, we don't no. we don't really need. I'm just you think you you, you think you, you think entitled to his own opinion. I'm just listening. I ain't. I ain't. No, no. <laughs> I'm just listening. So you so you you, you really yeah, think y'all listen, coming just to mop shit? Just to mop. We're sweeping. We're oh coming to sweep. Listen, they already know. They sweet. already know who y'all. You know I'm saying, you know what I mean. So I'm thinking, you, I'm thinking, sweeper. I'm thinking, you was gonna come with the shit. It's the quiet nigga. Yeah, he come here popping the shit. Okay, so it was normally it was a little husky dude with the dress. He's <laughs> normally doing all yeah, the loud. That's how I crazy. got my coach's cap. It was like even kill. Okay, I'm gonna mm-hmm. cool, lay back cool, reserve. Cool. I'm saying cool. I got my guy. You know That's cool. <laughs> but when y'all play VH, that shit can go out the door. Mm-hmm. All that cool guy shit, you gonna talk? <laughs> you gonna turn that shit up? He tried that it's shit. Real, it's real offense. He tried that shit. Listen, mm-hmm. I could have had a fucking defense. listen. I could have had a bullhorn, bro. On it, hey yo, we gonna whoop y'all out, bro. I've been on a sideline to get this motherfucker to react, bro. Because the other coach, oh, what's the, what's the guy? Uh, um, Bill. Kane, uh, Cannon, Cannon Pop. Yeah, Benz. Yeah, yeah Benz ain't doing no shit talking. Yeah, no. He'll do it in the huddle. I heard. I seen the uh, the uh, sport video. Yeah, um, motivated. Was, I seen when y'all was under the tent. Yeah, I mean y'all had some shit to talk about. Yeah, yeah, motivated. So that's cool. Bro. So he'll do his thing. He just won't. He won't do it like right out there. He'll do it like sparingly and shit like that. Mm-hmm. But that's cool. But uh, the tech couldn't be here, and I, I was going and I was up in the air about it. But I was I tried to hit Finch up, but I remember they had practice today. I was looking to see the workout. Yeah. So yeah, eventually he, we'll end doing, up. Yeah, he's he doing something good over there for West Philly. You think so? Whoa, 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 yeah, Why you old? That's our second time playing. Why the fuck is he been a nice guy? Why you been a nice guy? He finch ain't even here. 
Huh? He ain't even here. What you mean he got some nice shit going on? That shit is I, sh- I'm just saying. He had a nice, saying, no, had no, a nice no. squad over there, though. Nah, he, he, yeah, I think really, he, no, nah, no, nah, they, they, they. You, everybody ought to come down to coach and really, you know I mean, how much you put into them players at the end of the day. Yeah, I, I, but right. I never seen him, I never seen him coach, though. Mm-hmm. I was just talking shit, by the way. It's all, but I respect everybody, <laughs> what everybody doing. But I didn't see him coach until he played against the Chargers. I think it was in the championship. Then they played the D2, the Nines. Who, the Panthers? Yeah. They played the D2 no, chip against no, the Black Hawks. No, they played the Black Hawks in D2 chip. Nah, not, not at the oh, Nines. The Nines? The nines. Yeah. I think it was one of oh, the eight. Yeah, like eight or an eight D2 or nines or something like that. Mm. He coached against, I think it was one of the Chargers or some shit like that, and they end up losing. No, the nine, our nines didn't go D2. Oh. Or I don't eight. know about nine, yeah. Okay, so I just got to do my, I, I got to, okay. Okay. <laughs> I cannot fucking wait. I don't know who make this schedule. Give me I these little fucking bumblebee little spring? fuckers. I know in spring? Y'all huh? know in spring? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But if y'all doing spring, y'all not you in just give me. Huh? That New Jersey league? No. And then y'all was on the, y'all was on the schedule. Uh, no. On last, last year? They got, they got a couple. Oh, this year. Like, they got a couple the teams. The older, like, older teams in there. It ain't the young. Okay, no. Nah. Now yeah, I'm no, listen, okay. listen. I'm, I'm. This shit, all this shit is, is, is not foreign territory to me. But like I said, I had 13 U last year, so this is. I'm coming down to build a new motherfucking empire, and I'm, I'm telling y'all, I like y'all new little shit y'all got going on. Y'all nice little workout videos and all that bullshit y'all got. I won't break that shit in half. <laughs> I'm like, I know, just hold on. You the reason why you working out, though. Dang, huh? You saying that shit, you like it. You yeah. the reason you working out yeah. right there. Yeah. Hold up. Congratulations for taking that. <laughs> no, this guy, if I would have disrespected you last year and told you I was going to wake you the fuck out, when he made that statement, he looked right to the right. I don't know what's up these red and black to the right. I'm telling you. <laughs> he didn't even power out. So I was going to tell you this. Oh, they on. Listen, we know what the championship going to be. Listen, I'm going to tell you this. I'm going to tell you this. Gang up on You know what the championship game going to be. I mean, you look at it like, I mean, right now, the day in the world. This day. Were. I'm stepping into their world now. If they was at 13, they I would tell them I put 100 points up on them, mm-hmm. and it would be facts because they because I know because I know for a fact that they wouldn't be able to beat me at 13. It would do that. That's a big I'm F. My lane for right so, now. Thank you, thank you. Thank <laughs> you. No, that's what I'm saying. I'm, look, I'm, re- I'm respecting y'all lane. Y'all six or seven guys. Mm-hmm. Y'all been doing it. I'm I'm, I'm new to this. Yeah. Like you said, it, 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 it ain't so foreign to you. It's very foreign to me. That's my first year coaching too. I went undefeated. I never coached. I lost one time, and that was outside the PA league. Yeah, I know. I mean, just period coaching, like no. I'm just saying, like you know, so so everything new. Even that game against them was a so learning say, experience. Give me, like other than Sturgis, give me, give me a top quality opponent you had. Other than Sturgis, I say Aztec. They was they had work. They I mean could have been coached better, but they had pieces. Definitely had pieces. Mm-hmm. I feel like a lot of our games we out coach people. That's because not our team was the same. We didn't have a group. We had I had two two running backs. We ain't had no a whole team full of kids. That's just, you know what I mean? That's Second year players. But that's a testament to the, Yeah, all our teams, first year players That's a testament like to the coaching, though. Yeah. That's like, what I'm saying. That's why I appreciate the, like, the, shit, the shit y'all are doing. Like, y'all really doing a great job. These kids is playing hard. They playing real football, and that's the thing. So, a lot mm-hmm. back, like, they didn't really give us credit for that. They think it's everything. Yeah. Run straight, run left, run right. Yeah. Superman one, SpongeBob two. <laughs> so, they not really, like, thinking that no. we can really, like, do this shit. You really call them plays. See, in the that's, that, really that's, that's what I got. That's what I got to get team. used to. Yeah, mm-hmm. like you know, kids, you breaking it down to them that way. You know, we we in the huddle, blah 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 oh, blah yeah, blah blah. Yeah. There you like, there you can't say that to a six year old. All right, run right, run left. Yeah. I don't even know what to call. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So like I said, it's foreign. But the worst part is if you let me get if you let me get like a hang of this shit on how it's done, it's gonna be scary for people because like I think. The younger ages is where the culture matters the most. You ain't got to have 25 studs like we would have at 13s. Mm-hmm. If you can get a good team that listen and, and want to learn and get better, they may, even if they lose the first two games, they can run all five. It's all in, it's all in, it's, it, it's not about the coaches, it's all about the kids, but at that age, it's really about like the, how the work we put into them. Like we really have to pitch those kids in the right position, mm-hmm. teach them how to get in the proper stance, Evaluate. how to take a handle, and right. shit like that's that. A, like you really have to coach that we don't get. Like even at that age, where though we might get a kid that come in that's tough, that he mm-hmm. know how to play, but you still got to teach him how to take a teach handle. The whole game. You still got to teach him the game, mm-hmm. and that shit is hard. Versus when you getting these kids that's already 10, 11, 12, 13 years old, mm-hmm. they probably already studs. The coach, a good coach, probably already had hands on them. Right. Now you just getting to drive the car. But right. here, we really have to do this shit. Like, we really got to coach. And we making gotta, them understand the situation of the game. They, you know, some kids don't be knowing what score the game is. Like They could be getting bombed by 30 yeah. or some shit like that, and they're running around still playing. And then we got to also deal with parents. That's, mm-hmm. that's, 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 
It's another beast. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like, that's another thing. Yeah, they don't they don't understand with that. Like we got to deal with fucking parents, bro. Mm-hmm. It ain't, and then like it ain't. We have to get them to be on board too, because mm-hmm. it's not it's not the fact that like we can just give our young boys a schedule and a practice to get them to show up. Nah, mm-hmm. we have to nah, get it to their parents. Got, yeah, yeah. So we it's had to work with the parents, right? right so we got to deal with the parent all week. Sure the ship seller. Yes, sir. We mm-hmm. got to deal with the parent all week, and then we got to come down now. Once we get the two hours uh, a day with them, we got to deal mm-hmm. with the kid. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's, it's it's very tough, man. The job that we got, man, this shit's not to be taken lightly. Yeah. But again, now you have a bunch of all that shit in one pot, bro. You have all these good coaches and these good teams all in one stone pot, and they got to see each other. The game got to get played. Somebody got to fucking win and somebody got to lose. No doubt. You know what I mean? And it's going to fuck down. But I want to switch gears a little bit about this recruiting shit that's going on. How do you feel, y'all? How y'all feel about it? Are y'all okay with it? I could start off by saying I'm, 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 I'm iffy with it. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm cool with it because, like I said, if you winning, if you getting all the top recruits and you getting all the good kids, yeah. of course you're gonna be hype about it. So I want, I want, I want to sound like a hater or just because mm-hmm. I ain't getting all the top kids or I ain't really with it. My thing is, I'm used to getting from an era where as though we had the coach who came to the gate. Yeah. When I had the '75 shit, when I was doing it, it was about calling. A fucking a, a dude because you know his son and getting him and all the type of shit like mm-hmm. that, building all these super teams, bro. I don't want a person that don't want to deal with that shit because you got to play all them fucking kids. Yeah. So you can build that team. Best believe you're going to pay. Parents ain't spending time out of their work day when they can be doing something most, spending time on all this fucking visors and back plates that these kids want and so forth mm-hmm. and so on. And then at that age as well, a lot of parents, like their kids don't even really be into it for the yeah. real competitive state. Some of them treated like fucking daycare. Yeah. Or like camp, it just be something for their kids to do. Mm-hmm. So you know what I mean? It's just a lot they have to deal with, man. Dealing with the fucking kids and then dealing with the parents. Excuse my yeah. French when I say dealing with the kids. We love what we do, but it gets crazy uh, sometimes. Patience, like, especially like at the, the young yeah. age, man. It been sometimes you gotta that practice. That should be like, man. We gotta get through the day with these young boys, my right? Man, listen again. <laughs> I came from thirteen U. I came from thirteen U, bro. The first workout. I said, what the fuck did I sign up for? <laughs> I said, no way, bro. Did I agree to get back to this Four shit? Four years boy? straight, yeah. six year coach. I, I finally left oh, it alone. Man. Now I'm just trying to expand. Patience, man. Real oh, man. patience, bro. Yeah, you gotta have real it's patience. Take a lot. Mm-hmm. So, how you feel about it, dude, with the recruiting thing? Are you okay with it? You good with it? You don't really care for about it? How you feel about it, bro? I mean, look, I say this to people all the time. People tell me I'm crazy. Um, back in the day, my mom, Pop Warner used to have, you couldn't go to Florida till you was what, 10? Mm hmm. I'm. I was always cool with that because I feel like at the younger ages is is about you know teaching and them getting better. Mm-hmm. And like I said, I ain't saying that just to look good on the camera. I'm being 100. Like my team this year at Savage, yeah, well, I want to win a championship, yeah. But what's the point of winning a championship if I just had one player score 25 touchdowns in the season, right? So it's like development. So all the recruiting stuff, I ain't even doing that. Now at 13s, I go and get this kid, that kid, this mm-hmm. kid, that kid. I'm going to just coach what comes at seven. So I ain't really huge on the recruiting. To be real with you. But you look at it, if everybody doing it and you a coach that wanna win, you gotta you gotta adapt to it. So you yeah. wanna do what they do. But also I think that's a I think that's a, a benefit for us, because with them guys having their kids for maybe one, two years already, I think it's more of a hungry thing for us. We got a bigger fucking uphill like challenge to go. Right. Cause it's not mm-hmm. only do we have to coach kids and get a new playbook and get them to know well, we really building the shit from yeah. the ground up. Ground we up. just was coaching swing pads and jet sweeps and all this other crazy shit mm-hmm. that you really can't run With that had one. this level. So you really got to dump all that shit down. Keep this shit 100, bro. That's the reason why I even came to sevens. Was that like I, I came to sevens because I was tired of dealing with I just like the peace. Like that's what I'm saying. Because you look at like no egos. You look at 13s, like we had plenty of days, me, you. Uh, y'all the Panthers, us the Panthers, whoever, trash talk. We yell into the top of our lungs. We can't even talk no more. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Dudes ready to <laughs> throw blues at each other, stuff like that, over 13-year-old kids, man. It's too much. Mm. It ain't even that deep. So, you know what, let me, I'm going to take a year. Maybe I'm not going to lie. I'm going to take a couple years mm. and stay low, <laughs> you know what I mean, and just do it. Like You having success. They ain't allowed, they not gonna, the city not going to allow you to stay low. Mm-hmm. Well, success. I mean, listen, I, I'm, I'm going to tell you the bigger thing. My my org, for my org, mm-hmm. I need to move to the babies. Mm-hmm. Because if you look at my org, yeah, we win championships, but it's at the older ages. Mm-hmm. But how is that helping my org? My org ain't benefiting that way. My org winning 13, 14 every year, going to Florida every year, 13, 14, year, but them kids is out of the program. And that's why we got to catch these motherfuckers. Because they <laughs> already headed the game. We've been doing it for a while, maybe probably longer than them. 
But right. they're ahead of the curve when it comes to the back that the level we at. Right. They already yeah. probably got a car already. It, it, they just it, fine tuning. It, 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 we sitting here buying fucking parts. Yeah, it ain't gonna you know take that long. No, I know that. It ain't gonna take that long. Cause it's 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 gonna take long, bro. I mean, and it's no don't cause when cause once them cause everything gonna be fine right now. But once the actual workouts come when everybody start playing their spring and shit, when the floodgates open up. Oh, 11th Street get crazy, baby. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. And I ain't going to front. Listen. Like, this shit's like a picking pot. It's like, right now, you, you got to be, for the couple of workouts that I did, bro, you, you got to be grinding because you be like, damn, the numbers is light. Mm-hmm. But you got to also remember, we are, because of this shit from down south of how competitive it is, some guys just def- just finished Florida in December. Bro, some we parents, back working out in January. Some parents is taking that old break. Oh, yeah. Through the gym, I, bro, bro, his parents mm-hmm. sound burnt out. Yeah. Oh, he need yeah. a break. Then you got some other kids that like you got to respect start, it. I feel like we got to start early now, though. Yeah, That's what they do down south, though. You like, just hungry. Just, yeah. You like, just hungry. Well, you well, catching well, up. Yeah, down south is 85 up, degrees, too, bro. So. It's yeah. different, right? Yeah. That's, That's why. They got a shitload of uh, land. Yep, all over. So they, ain't really, they don't really need like fucking field access? Like, I ain't going to lie. Like, I talk, like I got, like I got a lot. Doing this football thing, like, you know, I'm cool with a lot of dudes from over Cali, dudes from down Florida, just from competing with them and just rapping with them, man. My man said all the time, he was like, bro, we be we be ahead of y'all because we do this all year. Like, we might not do football all year or do spring, but that 707 is in full effect. Like, I just was down Miami last week mm. on a set on a battle 707 training with, with, uh, with my uh, 15 U team. And it's just different. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's 92 degrees out there. Mm. We down there in Miami playing in this joint. We had the University of Miami. Just, just, it's just different. So, I mean, I get the burnt out part or whatever, but how you getting better? You got that's what you gotta look at it. Like, you know, it don't gotta be on the field, it could be like just doing some other stuff, but right. you gotta keep working. All right, so what y'all want Sturgis, what y'all want in the championship? What's the recruiter like for y'all? Are y'all guys doing it or are you just like, hey man, y'all gonna come see us, we the top dog, we the show as your shirt say. I'm yeah. um, are you still recruiting or we still we still taking kids, but we No 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 got, don't don't do that. Don't give me that modest <laughs> ass. We still <laughs> taking kids, I but we're taking kids. Of course we're taking kids. We're seventy five. We we're seven you. We, we gotta do I mean we're gonna take kids. PA elite, though, I can't take too many kids though, because you know it's the mandatory and all that. So, so we got the chilling. whole team coming back from last year. Right. So okay, I just so need to uh, do I need to add my parts, add my so, so y'all players. so y'all pretty much already fine too. We fine too. Y'all just already. need to add a couple little add a little couple couple little tweak here here and there. We right, okay. go. And this, what's up, Juice? Definitely got to add some players. No, we working, though. You yeah. know what I mean? We got our pieces coming. You know what I mean? People that want to join and all that. But we really t- we got open arms to everybody that really. It's still an organization. It's still youth football. We're still mm-hmm. giving back to the kids at the end of the day. Yeah. So, you know what I mean? You want to come join the family. We welcome yeah. with open arms. We ain't really tripping about the recruiting. We, you know what I mean, you gonna yeah, make your decision that shit yeah, at the end of the yeah, day. The end of the I ain't day, chasing it's no parent. parent. It's the parents. You, <laughs> you gonna take them where they want to play. Like. She gonna like your program, and but, that's why I like with the recruiting. Then, like you said earlier, that's why I look at the recruiting. Like it's changing, like the high schools now, because like when you get older, what high schools do you think about in the city? Mm. You think about Roman Catholic, West Catholic, St. Joseph Prep, like the top schools, MOTEP, the school. So now that's what programs, low league programs, turn mm-hmm. into. So now they turn into the programs to put your child into if you want to compete with the top people that's going out of state. Because now when we get out of st- out of the state, I ain't gonna, I, I sat down there in the regional games last year. It's a Philly thing. I don't care if you got another team. I'm down there cheering for you, bro. Yeah. Because we down yeah. there together. Yeah. I don't At care. the end of the day, we, 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 we going city, out of town. Yeah. Like, like in the preseason, if I see y'all playing any DMV teams, yeah. you know, yeah. I mean, that's I'm a good way. And, 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 and that's a that's a great thing that y'all guys is on it. For man, dude, trust me, dude. That telling that shit ain't like that. Mm. But a lot of guys that's around y'all. Y'all you wanted y'all, to be what y'all, right. What y'all saying yeah. right now is what a lot of people wanted to be. Yeah. But it ain't that. But getting now that we got the keys to the seven year, we got the keys to the future of the city. We mm-hmm. can start that. You know what yeah, I mean? We can fact. we it, we can be competitive. You know what I mean? But respect is everything. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I definitely respect everything y'all doing. As man, I appreciate everything y'all doing. Mm-hmm. Although we wearing different colors and different uniforms, I know firsthand the seven year shit is not easy. It takes time mm-hmm. and dedication from your life and other patience. things that you could be doing. So mm-hmm. I definitely again, although like I said, I want to rip all you motherfuckers to stress when mm-hmm. we come to the game. <laughs> Believe it, y'all gonna that. see. It's we like we a cool full time like job. We rapping, yeah, it's like a full time job, but you gotta have fun with it too. Yeah, man. yeah, yeah. yeah. So, it, I'm gonna tell you, man. Don't listen, y'all. Y'all been here for a minute, man. Don't let the two two old heads come down and, and take over <laughs> y'all. Good. Take over y'all. That's shit. good to everybody coming from. No, you know what I'm saying? Like that. That's a bad look. Low. You know what I'm saying? You know, it, 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 it look bad yeah. for the future. You know what I'm saying? More competition, listen. man. Oh, wow. 
Listen, these World cameras, these cameras work. I heard you. I heard you. I, I, I heard you. I heard you. Come with Beyonce, dominate. I always That's listen. listen, listen. listen. I always, I always hear them. Mm-hmm. I always hear them. But then when the clock hit double zero, you don't hear them no more. They get real mm-hmm. quiet. Listen, these cameras you work. Mean? Listen, these I'm, cameras I'm still the king, bro. I'm still the king, bro. No matter where you do this. These these cameras work, and he already said we know who's gonna be in the championship. Yeah. I know what he meant by that, and I love it. I love it because one of these motherfuckers, BH, is gonna see first on the schedule. Mm-hmm. Yeah, listen, we'll take we'll take anybody. We'll take charges huh? week one. Yeah, we want we want y'all. <laughs> our kid, mm-hmm. you, you didn't play our kid. Our kid was five. Mm-hmm. Our whole team come back at six. They were all five, and you ain't played me. I'm telling guarantee. Listen, you from Frankfurt? Listen, y'all from Frankfurt, right? Y'all can go no, back to Frankfurt. Any Frankfurt. coach your organization. organization. That's the crazy no, I'm talking, thing. Y'all, y'all organization is Frankfurt. Y'all got to take y'all. Listen, we just like the when colors. So when, I talk, when I talk football, I don't <laughs> talk South Philly, West Philly, none of that stuff, whatever, because we, we football coaches. We ain't gangsters, right? <laughs> so I look at it like, y'all, Frankfurt Charger coaches. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just know when I go to Frankfurt, everybody up there know who I am. Because mm-hmm. <laughs> I because I mean, they they know who I am because they've been the going past. on for a minute and it's not going to stop because shit. I want the sevens. You know what I'm saying? Three hundred, right? We keep it. We keep, we keep it three hundred, right? Hey, bro, I never lost. Listen, I, don't think it's, about about I, don't think I don't think it's a field in this city. I don't think it's a. I don't personally think. I don't personally think it's a field in this city. A field in this city where they could be like, oh, snaps, damn, dude got a team. Well, I've been coaching since 2011. I never, I never had a close game with the fucking Chargers, so I don't know what these fucking guys talking about. We still ain't losing. How many close games you have the Sharks? What's up, bro? We doing this today? I'm just saying, bro. Are Listen, we doing this today? I'm only speaking in the sense of no, we not. We not. This for another episode. Well, it's for another episode. It's for another episode. Like said, for another episode. Like said, another episode. We're gonna have another episode. Okay. So mm-hmm. I'm, I'm just, to do with y'all. I'm, I'm this just, is, listen, is, listen. I'm, I'm just saying, like, what the worst thing you could do is let somebody like myself or or even DJ that mm-hmm. been doing this for a minute, been winning, doing mm-hmm. even on the national side of things, get used to this seven U division because mm-hmm. the just, experience matters. That's what we just, want too. So it's just to me about diving. It's just to me about getting back All in that, that fucking car, going around that lap for the first time, bro. And that's and what then that's it. It. I never help, been there help, before. It helps us. I came in at twelve. Coach, I came man. in at eleven and twelve. We just so. started out, so we. I mean, I'm sharp my iron. No, no, listen, the, the young old Jesus head, my man. I'm sharp my iron. Y'all got. And I'm, gonna tell, I'm, I'm gonna tell you straight up. Y'all got a fucking coach. Ain't no doubt. Y'all got a coach, and we from an era. See, I had a playbook at six years. We coaching, but we come from an era. Right, right, right. <laughs> and that's cool. That's cool. But you got you want you want to you got to use that shit against somebody now. Yeah, you see, we was motioning right. and everything. You saw what I was doing on the field against y'all. I said that play was for you. And we scored. And, and, and that set motion, it right up for him. And that motion that you ran. Yeah, motion kid, and everything. That kid what made it out the fucking backfield against my defense. Yeah. So I'm telling you. Saw you saw my young boy's quarter pass and yeah. everything. 10 yeah. yard pass and yeah. all I ain't, that. I ain't, I ain't impressed by that. Oh. Nah, listen, listen, I, I, listen I, I respect the whole seven you think. Yeah. I think y'all got the experience because y'all are there. We got the experience because we did we've been we've been playing bigger competition. Mm. We all got so it, it all mad. Like y'all new to it. And we've been kind of doing it for a little bit. Like, I ain't even that old. So, for the first year, like yeah. for the first year, for yeah, the first year, y'all just going to have to watch this, this is, work. This is, this I mean, listen, this is the work. thing. <laughs> if, if we, yeah. we got to watch our work, y'all going to have to make us watch our work. We ain't just going to be like, all right, well, let's just see what's going on. Damn, they doing it, doing it. I'm like, this is the thing about it. I'm this one thing, like I said, I said it already, what I'm going to guarantee. All y'all in here with this red and black shit, bro. The night before, y'all fucking play BH. Mm-hmm. I promise you, it won't be no chill night. You ain't gonna be sitting there looking at cool. Your arms <laughs> definitely gonna stay folded like that because you got something to worry about. All that shit. You Everybody talk- got different shit about. That's, <sighs> see, you ain't gonna have to worry about me. You got to worry about him. That's for what I real said. I'm gonna talk to you in fourth quarter. No, shit no. no, no, no. Listen, man, you gonna talk to you? You ain't game. gonna be looking at me in the game. You gonna be looking at him. <laughs> listen to me, fourth quarter. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out prolific photos. That's what we don't. That's the bit. Oh, the business don't stop, baby. The business. The business boy. If I got to sit that motherfucker, like, listen. If I got to sit that motherfucker, like, like I got a nail call and play motherfucker. That's what we doing. The lights got to stay on. Fuck that. But yeah, man. Before we get the fuck out of here, bro. Like I said, I appreciate everything y'all guys is doing, man. Y'all guys that's watching. Y'all other coaches. Y'all other teams. Y'all other leagues. Pay attention. Watch the seven U on the Philly level, man. Watch how we moving. I want to see some real football at the younger level. Oh, yeah, you're going to see it this year. Ain't no doubt. You're going to see it this year. And we ain't just talking about the city. We got some things that we're going to talk about amongst ourselves. Iron sharpens iron. We're going to box out in the city for a minute. Oh, but y'all going to know about us on the national stage, too. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? I'm talking about BH, man. North Philly Black Cause. I'm talking about the South Philly Sharks. Sturgis Hornets, man. Frankfurt Chargers. Mm-hmm. Powerhouses. On the DMV tour. This Powerhouses. Mm-hmm. This preseason. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, and they going to raise you up. We got and y'all got to know. So again, we got DMV nights coming up. That's 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 what the Philly thinks for to go down, man. Listen, I'm cool with. Us taking our sevens and going down there and going against the DMV. I mean, yeah. stuff like that. I mean, we support mm-hmm. each other. That's something that we can. That's something yeah. that we can definitely we can talk, talk about. Definitely talk that's about something that, that we definitely could talk mm-hmm. about. And I was about to get to that. I was about to leave. I was about to end off on that for the part two, because that's what's going to shake the motherfucking ground. If we pull that off, <laughs> that's going to be that's going to be huge because nobody else has done it. Yeah. A lot of people is talking about it, and nobody else done it. Mm-hmm. And we all got the talent. We got the coaching all the way around the board, and we all know what it take. It ain't no so much of he doing this over there. We all know how tough it is to coach five, six, and seven years yeah. on all levels. So we know what it all take. Mm-hmm. So yeah. So after we handle this business, we clean up this city or whatever in the state with the state chip and all that. Oh, we definitely can talk about that. I don't think they want to see that. No I don't think they want to see that. And it's a difference when we got you can say here, you can talk competitive, talk your shit, pop your shit, and then we can still talk about handling this business. Don't get it fucked up. It's a Philly thing, mm-hmm. right at this level. We ain't got nothing to do with nobody else's doing. So I cost the bosses me. That's why we here right now. This is the future of the city, and this is what we doing. So what y'all been hearing, what y'all been saying, y'all be doing. Oh, the shit about to be different. Uh, like I said, we gonna handle our business with each other, but don't think mm-hmm. for a second we won't form this shit up on y'all. Come the sweep the fucking the DMV side. up. Mm-hmm. Or we start coming down south, start taking some of that money. Right now we mm-hmm. gonna pace it though. We gonna get our money up here first, but y'all gonna see us though. Oh, but do man, before we get out of here, brother, anything you wanted to say? Anything you, you know I mean? Somebody need to know about what's going on now, SP? No, I mean, not much. I said we building it up top to bottom. Um, like I said, we, we got everything going on, 14U available. I know a lot of guys um, that ain't ready to go. A lot of programs don't offer it. You know, if you guys want to play some real meaningful football, we got some stuff going on there on the 14U level. Um Outside of that, I mean, look, I see y'all dudes. I see y'all dudes at the fifty. I mean, I'm, I'm amped. I'm ready. What's up, gang? What's up, stage? What's up? What's up? What's the deal? You've been talking shit all day. Mm-hmm. Let the folks know, man. Would you anything, mm-hmm. anything you want to leave them with? It could be a message to the people, a message to your folk. However, you want to just we back to work. That's it. We back to work. Uh, we just started yesterday, so from now and we just grind it all the way through. Get ready for the spring. Seven on seven. Get ready for the preseason. We're gonna load it up. We're gonna. Get ready to rock. Yeah, yeah. What's up, mm-hmm. Juice? Talk to me, bro. Talk to me. Man, it was on there like, Coach Juice going to talk this shit. shit. They, they tagging gonna me and shit. Coach Juice going to talk this. <laughs> I'm like, all right, what you need to do? He ain't be feast. My fuck ain't play me. <laughs> well, all right, son. What's up, though, Juice? What's we going on? on talk to him. We on our prove it year right here. Yeah. We, we got to show him what we about this year. I feel like this year bigger than last year. Last mm-hmm. year don't even matter this year. So we more, even more dedicated this year. More invested this year. Anybody in our way, just come correct. That's all I'm going to say. Just come correct. Oh, there ain't no baby coaching over here. Just be ready to play football. That's all. I got you. That's love. So it's in our title. Yeah. As a go down BH, and I mean, we, we had a little tough year last year. You know what I mean? Hit the little wall we hit. But best believe, though, you motherfuckers that know me know this ain't that type of show. Oh, we coming to work. We coming to own our motherfucking trophy like it is. That trophy will be coming back right where we standing at. Right here in our home. Should have brought the trophy, man. Yeah, you should have. You should have. Listen, listen. Listen, listen. As y'all should. Yeah, look, to your, look to your right, brother. Take that home. You can look to your right, brother. I mean, there's plenty room. There's plenty room. No, 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 no. That you see, that's that's big shit over there. That's big shit. That's big shit. I mean, you got a couple more minutes. Go check it out. Go read the plaques under there. But no, seriously, man. Bh, man, we fucking coming, man. We out here. We gonna work hard. We gonna play hard. I demand toughness. I demand dedication. We're going to play the game the right way. Yeah, I mean, I ain't in all this. You know what I mean? I work behind the camera. I ain't the guy that's no me in front of it. This is new territory for me. I'm all about putting in the hard work. You know what I mean? When you winning, the camera going to find you. You know what I mean? The success going to find you. The camera's going to going to find you once the success pop, man. But I'm about hard work first. We're going to teach the kids the right way to play the game down here. And I think all the coaches can speak for the same and say the same about their kid. But it's up to you. That's going to be your choice. You got four powerhouses here in Philly. Take your pick. Mm-hmm. But I'm telling y'all, I'm going to see you at the finish line. Yeah, I understand that shit you're saying, Juice. I know that's your guy right here, you your little red and black buddy. Yeah, you, I mean, but I'm you my boy, you, we off the field. You know, when we locking on the field, you already I know got you, I got you, I got you. Yeah, and man. I see how hard you smiling. But at the, when, whenever, that, whenever that shit. Even you, take a lot. Listen to me. I'll shake your head after the game. I'm going to tell y'all now, whenever that championship day, I don't know who it is, I'm going to be there, Altif and Palms. And like, you're going to, I'm going to play this shit back. You know, I'm got i crazy with the camera. So, my man, <laughs> we gonna play some shit back, and we gonna talk. Yeah. We gonna get it on. But, dude, man, I'm 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 done with the young, but I'm definitely looking forward to playing you. I, I already know you. I 
I'm, I'm, so. I'm definitely looking for you. And, and then the thing about it, I'm anxious because watch the city. Watch how we bring the city out. It's not even so much. It's just about the babies. We're going to show them how, like, how that shit going with North Philly and South Philly going to come together for a motherfucking uh, a seven U game. And they were still just in the charge. I can't wait to y'all play against each other. Mm-hmm. Watch how the city come out for these joints. These games are going to be big games. Yeah. So every week, with all these guys in the same division, every week is going to be there in that big game. 23. Mm-hmm. A playoff game to see. It's be a great season, man. Yeah. Got and a lot of people on the league. list to cross yeah. off, man. Yeah. Yeah, man. That's what I was saying. So who first up? Whoever on that list. No, no, no. Whoever on that no, list. Listen, you got even your, even some of your man. young. I'm not even worrying about even whoever. I'm just worrying about not losing. Even some of your young yeah, boys tag me. Another undefeated season. Yeah, I'm worrying about not losing. I don't listen, care who on the list. I ain't trying to hear that mighty shit. <laughs> no, that's not even being mighty. It is. It is. I'm not. You know, we're not who losing. You, who's on the Who's on the list first? Yeah, who's on the Sturges. list first? I want what West Philly. I want listen. I ain't gonna lie. No, because Sturgis they already know they on the list. They already know they first on the list. Again, this platform. I've already asked for a game. This platform for those who don't know. Hey, these those who don't know. You know what I mean? Y'all got some fans that's watching. Y'all org that's watching. Y'all players and parents. What's up, Coach Juice? I say the only team. They tag me and say Coach Juice gonna talk. Only team that we got Sturgis. And I just want whip West Philly ass. Okay. I want they they think they the city. I want whip. I ain't worrying about the ass text no more. We beat them twice already. All right. What's up? What's up with you? Only, only, only had one. Only had a chance to play the Chargers from AYF mm-hmm. last year. So yeah. I'm just looking forward to playing this. All so you ready to you ready to walk yeah, in the door and have fun? Ready, ready to walk this in the door and have fun? I know that. I know that. I know that. This ain't little time time enough. Now you about to play this JoJo and Lola? Right in the same place. Nah, we ain't doing that. That's and, and that's what they used to say. Like, yo, yo y'all was in these set. Y'all was in these yeah. set. Oh, no. Now we now we ain't PA League. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And we ready to rock. Yeah. All say. right, man. What you going to say? Do I already know what it's hitting for? You got like, you ain't got too much to say. I ain't going to front. I ain't, I ain't going to front. I ain't even, I, I ain't even up on you. I'm up I'm up on these Charger Bulls now, man. Mm-hmm. Like, boy, I don't think somebody mocked my team last year. We ain't even play y'all. I ain't play y'all. I ain't play y'all. I ain't get you to play y'all. No. Somebody, somebody said it. Somebody said it. Somebody, somebody said it, somebody said it. Some somebody said it though. Everybody. Uh, it's 26 games. We had like 18s in the league. Okay. Sure. It was D2. He called y'all. He, listen. Listen. He did. They, 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 these young D2, boys is fucking D2. disrespectful. Yeah. He got a lot of work to do, just like you. Yeah. Hey, no, I'm I'm young, I'm just, hey, young, I'm young. They two D two teams. I don't have no listen, enemies, brother. Yeah, Anybody I, that feel like they put hands on my six U last year, come do the same thing to my seven. <laughs> That's all I would say. That's where I'm at. And that, that go for anybody. And you got the game fucked up. Listen, I, 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 this 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 BH, my man. It ain't never a rebuild over here. It ain't never a rebuild over yeah, here. It take, take a lot, though, to take a D2 team to... Why oh, you keep saying... He, he keep listen, calling y'all... No, 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 listen, brother. <laughs> hey, hey, listen. I'm okay with that. I was not motherfucker there, motherfucker. You know why I was at that shit. Right. And whatever the powers may be, I don't control that. I ain't the admin or, the, you know what I mean, the program director and that shit. I ain't none of that. Mm-hmm. I'm just here to kick some motherfucking ass. And anybody know I'm Coach DJ, down at that level, I've been, I've been moving down there. Mm-hmm. I'm moving down there for a lot of these newcomers that's been around. And I don't say that light. I'm, I'm not saying that to brag and boast. I'm saying that motherfuckers don't get it twisted. If BH is on your schedule, BH7, mm-hmm. you better come ready to play. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So I'm, I'm going to close y'all like that. I appreciate the Sharks coming through. The Sturgis Hornets, man. Frankfurt Chargers. It's the Blackhawks, man. man. North Philly. Appreciate That's how we're going to do it. We're out of here, man. Too. It's another episode of the Prolific Podcast. Again, shout out to the Sharks. Mm-hmm. Sturgis Hornets. Frankfurt Chargers, man. BH, we straight. We out of here.